All right, guys, so if you watched the last video uh, going to Test and Tune, we're in like a 12 2, uh, which we did run an 11 82 with the street tires. Uh, it's not launching very well. So, what I'm going to try to do is work on a, uh, a boost build slash anti lag um, advanced table in the Holly EFI. So, uh, we're going to pull us out of the garage. We're going to uh, hit two step probably at like 2800 rpms see how much boost we can build and then we're going to make up a uh, boost anti-lag table in the holly efi in one of the tables and uh, apply that and see if we can make any more boost i'm not sure if it's actually going to work so uh you're coming along for the ride so here's the table i came up with uh it's a timing offset table x axis is rpm a uh, switch enabled is this uh, enabled with input one is enabled, which is the button on the steering wheel, which enables two step also. If we scroll down, here's our table. So when we're on the button, it's not gonna start pulling any timing until we get to 2650. It's gonna start slowly pulling timing and then pull it all uh, nine degrees we're just going to start out with not sure what it's going to do um it's going to pull it all then the reason i didn't just put it all at nine whenever the button's pressed is because pulling that timing is going to labor the engine and it might not get up to the two step fast enough or at all um, so we're just going to try this um, and see what it does all right, guys, so we have to turn the rev limiter down to 2,500 or else it would just spin on the concrete. Uh, boost is up there, RPM's there, timing right there. shouldn't change much because we're not on the boost builder uh, anti-lag yet. Uh, and then boost is down there. So we're going to hit the button and then we're going to go full throttle. So I saw about two pounds, so we're going to... Uh, Hit our. We're gonna enable our our uh, anti lag table and see what it does. Just real quick, guys. Uh, this is how the table turned out. Uh, we just moved it to nine degrees at twenty three hundred down there. It was at like twenty eight, but it, we would have never. It would have never got up that high since we can't uh, hit that high of RPM launch in the driveway without it spinning. Uh, we could probably air it on the tires, but that's too much work. So. This is a kind of a proof of concept. Uh, see what see what it does. There is four pounds right there. Pulling the brake as hard as I can. So, uh, proof of concept. It works. So, uh, <laughs> uh, we'll, I'll look back and see what that was and put it on the screen. It's kind of quick because the tires are spinning a little bit, but. So, proof of concept. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. I uh, hope this helped. And uh, we'll be messing with that at the track next time we go to the testing tune. So, uh, like, subscribe. See you later.